Welcome to the Hydraulic Press channel. Today we are going to crush some rocks. And we have a couple of lava stones. And I have myself bringing those from the Canarian, Canary Island, Island, Islands. And the small one on the front, that's our self-made lava stone. And then we have that shiny thing with colors and shit. <laughs> I don't remember what that is. Amethyst. Uh, amethyst. And then we have some selenite. Yeah, let's start with the lava stones. So the first lava stone is from uh, Fuerteventura Island. And I think this is quite typical lava stone. Looks quite soft, so it shouldn't be a problem. <laughs> and here we go! The next stone is from Lanzarote. It's a bit more dense, it don't have those air bubbles so much inside of it. So maybe this one is a bit harder to crush. And here we go! I think it was a bit harder, but still quite weak. <laughs> And the next one is a bit uh, rarer stone, it's Finnish lava stone. <laughs> and if you want to know where, the, where you can find lava stones in Finland, <laughs> check out the description and end screen. We have our uh, lava making video there. <laughs> that was the weakest. Lava stone ever. <laughs> and then the next one is this amethyst. I think this is much harder than those lava rocks because it's so heavy. And here we go! one we have this selenite and as always with these minerals when you are trying to find if they are like toxic you run run to these really interesting facts so the selenite the white or transparent crystals have a strong vibration that may open the crown chakra and the soul star chakra <laughs> so I think this would be excellent and here we go! Yeah, but I think that was all for today. Thank you for watching. And have a nice day. And for today's extra content, we have these strange things. <laughs> I have no idea are they really dangerous, but I have seen things where they like to eat eat each other. So after only the strongest is survived, it can attack against us. So they are extremely dangerous and I have to deal with them. <laughs> I think this was quite good to have many things under there. <laughs>